Hello Lilas, welcome back to my channel. Guys, I am here with Gigi. Gigi is the Gianna Sculpt by Kathy Biscotti. Biscotti, Biscotti, Biscotti. It's Kathy Romero Biscotti. Biscotti. I don't know which way she pronounced it. Um, she's from Silicon Studio. Uh, someone asked me, they were like, I can't find the George and Gianna Sculpt. You have to go to uh, Silicon Studio, the number two dot com. That's where you find her sculpts at. And then for Jennifer Price, hers is at just siliconestudio.com. So they have two websites now. They split it up because they said it was easier for them for shipping and stuff because some coming from one place and the other. Um, they're business partners, but um, they, they are um, obviously they don't live together and stuff. So, um, yeah. So, I thought she was so cute in that outfit, so I decided I wanted to put her on this outfit. And it's, like, the similar color. So, I'm going to put her on this, and probably for the week, she'll be done. Um, I know sometimes the lighting washes her color out a little bit, but, um, then if not, it'll just be too dark so if I zoom in on her hold on you can see a little bit more of her detail like you can see the veining in her forehead and stuff but you can't see it <laughs> when it's the camera is like zoomed out and because she's further away so you don't get to see as much detail but let's get her dressed and then um yeah so I put her up for sale for a couple hours one day we said I was like I'll sell her as a ball baby because I'm just like overwhelmed with rooting with how many heads I have to root I actually don't mind rooting I just it's hard for me to sit still um it really is it's hard for me to sit still so that's my biggest thing with brooding. It's not so much the process itself. It is tedious, but look at that little bell button. Um, but yeah, as you guys know, she's a baldy. So we'll take her hat off. And I did give her like some little like baby, baby edges, just a little bit. I didn't give her as much as I do the other ones. I was just trying to get an idea, but, um, Either her or Jaden, I'll probably root afterwards. I'm really curious to see what she's going to look like with hair and Jaden. They're really... Um, I slowly add a little bit and a little bit to uh, India. So, I kind of... I'm kind of okay with her and her hats and stuff. Uh, more than I am with these, these babies. Cause they're bigger babies and I just feel like they need their, their their hair and especially for like dressing purposes I feel like um look at her I feel like she she needs her hair because I want to dress her all the time and some outfits don't have cute hats so it doesn't it take away from her her look her outfit so let's see we'll lay her down mess. um but like i tell people all the time because i get this all the time like oh i wish i could paint for myself um i would have every baby and you know i could save and all this and stuff and i i won't won't sit here and tell you that I don't save money by painting for myself because I don't have to pay anybody to paint for me obviously um when it comes to my silicone babies but it does cost me for the kit the material you know silicone has went up um so it it does cost me for that stuff it costs me uh, my time and then also you know, basically, it in the end, it cost me the same amount it would have cost anybody else because it's money that I, I have set 
in my budget to make for selling and now when I keep them it's like oh well no you don't get to uh, make that money so that's a loss and so I have to hurry up and you know make us up make something else available to sell to make up for it I'm debating if I want to change her diaper I think her diaper is still okay it's she's bored a little while so I still put her on newborn she has a pretty she's a big girl but she's pretty petite still and especially in the diaper area so I still put her on newborn size diapers and they fit really well um she's not like a very super chunky baby um she's she's got good size to her but she's just she's long more than anything and she does have you know, she has a good weight and size to her, but she's not a fat baby. So she still fits newborn really well. Um, I think if I put her on a bigger diaper, it'll be like saggy. I don't, I don't necessarily like that look on my babies. So newborn it is. See? So, wear that. But yeah, so I've been working really hard to make get finished with some babies so that I can um I can get her sold. I mean, get them sold and feel comfortable and not guilty for keeping her. <laughs> That's how it works, guys. Got to give up something else. I have babies in my private collection um and some I got recently and so I don't I'm not supposed to be buying any <laughs> more additional babies so that's 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 the thing so sometime when I'm saying I can't buy no more babies I can't buy no more babies you guys might not know but I no, I bought babies and they're just you guys just haven't seen them because I, I find that I love sharing so much but people love to give their opinions of your babies and stuff like that and sometimes no matter how hard we try to say that it doesn't bother us I think it does depending on who says it. Like say for instance, if it's one of your close friends or somebody and they keep saying they don't like your baby. Um, eventually, I think it does kind of like make you feel not some type of way about your friend, but the baby itself. You start overanalyzing and overthinking it too sometime, I think. Um, so I just, some babies that I really like and I really love and I think they are different in their own little way. I like to keep them to myself because I don't need other people's opinions of them. And I just want to enjoy my happy bubble of bliss. If I think they're perfect, I want to continue to think they're perfect. I don't need anyone to tell me otherwise. And that's just that. So, um, people can say some really, you know, harsh things oh, this is cute but it's too big let me see if I can tie it tighter you know I never understood how sometimes you ever bought an outfit and the hat say it's a newborn or a preemie and the hat is like huge no so this is actually together like that it doesn't allow you to tie it up more I can put a little knot in the back of it, but I don't, to be honest, I don't like doing all that. You can put a rubber band on it and make it tighter. I could like do this and then take it and fold it and put a, like a rubber band there. But I honestly don't like having to do all that. 
so i'll probably end up putting her back on a hat but i don't want to put her on pink on pink that's my only dilemma and i don't think that's why i don't know the hat oh i might have a hat but it's white or cream color and i don't well she do have the letters in the shirt like that um But yeah, I was just really happy with the way that um, Gigi turned out. I don't, I usually do a different paint technique or style on my babies. And I tried something else with her and I actually liked it. So um, I think that's why I'm so drawn to her, too, is because she's kind of got her own thing going on. And y'all know I be liking them little light brights. <laughs> so, um, so I think, I think that's part of why I love the sculpt. Of course, I've always been in love with the little face. Y'all know I like my babies. Back in the day, I used to always say my babies have allergies. They can't breathe. So she looks like she might be a little stuffy too. When you look at her little mouth being opened up like that. Um, so, I mean, I could keep her little band on. It is rather cute. Um, my baby does have um, armatures in her arms. And I love, I love them. I love her having them. Um, And Kathy got to see her in person, which was pretty cool. I actually sent her to her. And she got to see her in person. And then she actually came back to me. Let's see. I know, I know. So, like, in Australia and places like that, it is... It is, like, winter, I think. But here is summer, but it's okay. We're gonna pretend. And then, my, well, my air be so cold, and so I try not to keep the babies hot. So there we go. So I don't know. I think she can she can wear her little shirt. We'll worry about this little tie thing at a later date. Do you want to hold that? <laughs> So there she is, my little Gigi. Let me see what you guys can see. Um, but yeah, she'll probably keep this on for a little bit. So let me get you guys some light. So that is her. Her, her little toy toy and that's her little um pants i might put her on some socks i could actually can i i could put her on some socks i like seeing her feet out sometimes but she is really cute with socks on so i might put her on some white socks or she could wear oh those are yeah those i don't want to have on unicorns and uh puppy dogs uh i don't know i think the white socks will throw her outfit off so i probably need to find her some shoes put her on some darker shoes maybe because yeah that white because her her hat is a cream color, it's not a white. So I think the sock kind of, I think it kind of throws her off, her outfit off. Uh, I don't know what kind of shoes we have here. I have a lot of shoes, baby shoes though. I don't put my babies on shoes much, but her for some reason, I be wanting to put her on shoes. We got hard bottoms. I have, oh, those boots are a little too, too, uh, probably too 
too big for her. Um, oh, we're running out of time. I'm gonna put her on some boots. Put that girl on some boots. I know these are like, they might be pushing it on size, yeah. But she would look cute in boots. Oh, got stuck to the Velcro. But we'll see. Anyway, I'm gonna go. I'm probably, I probably won't put her on socks. But if I do, I would put her pants leg over the sock. Sometimes I put the sock over the pants leg sometimes. But in this case, I think I would want less of a sock to show. So I'm just put her. Oh, you guys can't even see. Huh. So see, I didn't want to throw her outfit off with the white. So I may go find her a different sock or a different shoe. But anyway, I will take pictures of her for Instagram. And you guys will get to see her. And yeah. Yeah, like you can't. I said it's a lot you don't see on camera but yeah that's my girl we'll we'll, we'll go from there thanks for watching guys